So earlier this week we got the latest patch for Outriders which added in many changes to the game. Today guys I want to give you my opinion on the differences I have felt in regards to legendary loot drops. How's it going guys my name's DPJ and if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more Outriders be sure to subscribe. So with the latest patch changes to legendaries were made by people can fly to basically make the game a little more generous with also the added conclusion of the anti-duplication system too. I jumped back on last night for the first time in ages to see if anything felt different. Now I do have a video planned in regards to general game changes but right now I just want to talk about legendary loot drops. So like I said I jumped on for the first time in absolute ages I think since the damage mitigation bug started a while back so it's been quite some time but as a content creator since I've started playing the game I record and make note of certain things within this game one of those things is legendary drops. So before I did any tier 15 expeditions, post patch, I went into my files and had a look at my runs and how often I did get these games rose to loot. And while I was really unlucky within my experiences, as I'd probably get legendaries literally every 3 to 4 runs, with some droughts lasting 5 runs and even more, before I saw a legendary drop. And with me it seemed as though expeditions like Time One Spire and Archways of Enoch were the more stingy. Now when I was getting legendary drops pre-patch I was getting a max at 2 legendaries. I think within my entire time playing this game I had one instance where I got 3 legendaries drop from one expedition and that was on a tier 14 on stream ages ago. But beyond this I get a max of 1 or 2 like every 3 or 4 runs on average. So yeah loot drops for me were pretty hurried pre-patch. So when going back into the game I made sure I looked for Time 1 Spire and Archways just to compare. And well guys the results are pretty great. The changes I feel are in full effect and are drastically better. Well in my experiences they are anyway. My first expedition back in months I got 3 legendaries off the bat and from there literally every run guys besides one I've done I've been getting double and triple drops every single time which was 100% not the case for me before. Now the luck system they improved for less droughts is definitely working. The 100% increase legendary drops is also definitely working. Now the anti dupe system for me at the moment although I'd say it's working I'm yet to get any of the 4 remaining legendaries I still need. But when you get those the legendaries drop within those expeditions you can kind of see they kind of pause on screen for a second it's like the game's rotated them or something so yeah it's definitely re-rolling the ones you've already got it's just a shame it doesn't guarantee you one you haven't got but then hey that would literally take away all the grind but all in all i do feel this patch and the feature it brings 100 percent is working for the better and in general makes the game feel more rewarding which actually guys makes me want to play it much much more so yes the latest patch is definitely a good one in regards to legend no loot drops and I feel if they keep doing things like this the game will get to a stage where it should have been at on release. Now I've got another video coming where I give you guys my thoughts on the patch in general and how the game feels for me after months of not playing so stay tuned for that one. But yes guys the end of the video has arrived and let me know your thoughts on this patch, post patch, legendaries, what's it like for you let me know. If you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out if you're new around here and want to see more outriders be sure to subscribe and if you never want to miss a video i upload you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button but guys thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully i will see you on that next one